dedication, entrepreneurship, work. It is said that the most successful people are the smartest and hardest workers there are. I mean the A students, CEOs and everyone who wants to achieve anything in their life. But how are they doing the unbelievable and are able to study and work up to 12 plus hours a day? Let me tell you their secrets. Hey, my name is Morris and I'm on the journey towards becoming the best version of myself, aka becoming not just someone. I'm one of the dreamers who want to make their goals reality. After deciding to claim my life as mine, I very soon understood that I need to work as hard and smart as the successful people in our time do. An obvious problem quickly appeared on my path towards my personal success. Distractions surround us all the time. If you eliminate one, two more appear. It's like Hercules killing Hydra. As soon as you cut one head off, two more growing back. Distractions aren't monsters. They can be far less noticeable, yet way more destructive. Those could be, for example, a colorful pen you scribble with, a bouncing eraser you play with, or a sheet of paper that I just recently used to build a paper plane on stream because I didn't want to study. But often, and especially nowadays, our mobile phones are the reason why we just can't focus. They became an integrated part of our lives and we became dependent on this device. I mean, phones are a news generator, meme creator, entertainment donator and contact maker. They let us stay in touch with our friends, family and partners. They give us the recent updates on the least important news and we just have to see the news posts on social media or watch this one more episode of the new show we just started. The difficult act of putting your phone aside for a couple of hours is natural but necessary to achieve your goals, your goals. Limiting your distractions is a part of discipline. To quote Jordan Peterson, you cannot aim at anything if you're completely undisciplined and untutored. But even if you're struggling with staying consistent and feel like the laziest human being ever, there are some tricks you can use to finally focus for a good amount of hours on one topic and eventually achieve all your goals. Limit your distractions. When you decide to start studying, turn your phone on Do Not Disturb or download the Forest app to plant some trees. And if nothing works, ban your phone completely from your room for that period of time. Don't contemplate on it, just do it. To track your sessions, use an analog timer instead of a digital one. I personally have used one for a year until I got disciplined enough to keep my phone next to me. The process of me doing that can be seen in my study with my livestream. If you live with your family or have roommates, tell them not to disturb you during your session because true supporters will always support you if you need them. To make it clear and to remind them on a regular basis, put a post-it on the outside of your door and write your study schedule on it. Some advices are just as easy as that. Discipline is built on daily routines. In other words, set yourself a fixed time every day in which you study and do nothing but studying. Studying therefore becomes a habit and you quickly get used to the sometimes exhausting process of it. Let me tell you, after a while you won't even notice the absence of your phone. Mark Zuckerberg takes a completely different approach. He, for example, limits the amount of decisions by wearing the same clothes every day. Distractions can be dealt with in very different ways. And I'm certain that you find your way to limit the ones that surround you.